Hey, hello friends. Welcome back to the vlog. It's so good to be out on my bike. First time I've been uh, able to get out in uh, over a week. And it just feels so good. Now I was meant to be riding with uh, Wayne Kearney and Wayne's friend, uh, Wayne's friend Paul this morning but over in Chesson but unfortunately my son went out last night texted me at three o'clock this morning and asked me if I could take him into work this morning because he's gonna leave he was leaving his car at um, one of his friends house parties or wherever he was last night so unfortunately I had to cancel my plans to ride with Wayne and uh, take Lewis into work. So I'm just out on my own now. Which is fine, it's all good. Wayne and Paul, I hope you have a cracking ride, guys. And you know what? The sun is shining as it peaks from behind the clouds. And it is really warm. I'm absolutely loving it compared to like just over a week ago when it was bloody freezing and snowing. It's really mild, so I'm loving it. I've got my uh, short fingered gloves on. Yeah, superb. And I'll tell you what, these speed play pedals, oh my days. I've only ridden, oh, pothole. I've only ridden like two miles but already and you know I posted it in the vlog yesterday but clipping in and clipping out is just so much easier and the power that I seem to be able to get down on the pedals maybe it's just a placebo effect but it feels so much better than the Shimano pedals that I was using so good and they're so light as well not that that really makes a difference to me. I've got the new handlebar tape on, looking fine. And of course I've got these Shimano 105 brake calipers that I fitted last weekend. This is the first time I've um, been able to get out and try them. And so far, so flipping good. Stopping power is greatly increased. I know a few of you legends commented on that on the uh, vlog last week when I was fit, fitting them to the bike so oh my days yeah a brand new lease of life for this cracking defy of mine and I'm hopefully fingers crossed going to be ordering some new wheels tonight but I'll keep you posted on that you legends there is still some remnants of snow left. That's crazy. Over a week since it snowed. And on this lane, there's still snow. Hey, and a happy Mother's Day to all you mums watching out there. Hope you have a good day.
I'm loving this sunshine. I've got me Castelli Perfetto on this morning, um, but I've put my arm warmers on underneath with a short sleeve jersey. But I really didn't need the arm warmers. It's crazy. Just done a one of my favourite climbs. I'm still on it. The toughest bits been and passed. Cheney's Hill. I know Paul Stevens of the crew smashes it up here. Morning to you, buddy. Hope you're good. Morning. Absolutely glorious out here. I've just ridden past a disgusting site. Take a look at this. Why anyone would want to dump chickens by the side of the lane, I have no idea. Utterly gross. Disgusting. My days, the mentality of some people. I have to say a big hello to Harry as well. Harry Stevens. I know you watched the vlog with your dad. So thank you very much. Hope you're all good. Don't say you want me. Don't say you need me. Don't say you love me. It's understood. Don't say you're happy. Out there without me. I know you can't be. Cause it's no good. One of my favourite pubs coming up on the right. The Bricklayer's Arms are absolutely beautiful. Tell you what these shimano 105 brakes are so good as many of you uh, said they would be so thank you guys absolutely brilliant set of calipers and i must say a massive thank you to all you subscribers out there old and new thank you so much for watching the channel it really is much appreciated So thank you everyone. I'm gonna take my time. So I don't know if you've seen it already, I know a few of you have. The FCC group ride event that I posted up on the Strava group yesterday for the 25th of March Richmond Park to Box Hill really looking forward to that guys it'd be so great to uh, meet you and ride with you legends but um, when I looked at it this morning the meet time said 10 o'clock and I changed it to 9 o'clock because the meeting time is nine o'clock for a 9.30 start, but it still showed up as 10 o'clock. So just to let you know, it is a nine, a 9 a.m. ish meet for a 9.30 start on the 25th of March. Oh my days, I'm gonna have to clean my cleats out when I get home now. That Audi just literally squeezed past me on this narrow lane. I had to put my foot in the yeah, muddy so verge. ignore that timing. If it says 10 o'clock, if you guys could let me know in the comments below, that'd be great. Because I've definitely changed it back to nine, but on my tablet and phone, it still says 10. But it's definitely a 9 a.m. meet for a 9.30 start. So cool. And I've put my mud guards back on this morning, only because we had so much rain yesterday. 
it was ridiculous. So rather than getting my back completely soaked, I fitted the uh, mud guards again. Had to make slight adjustments because the 105 brake calipers are a little bit more narrow. So whereas before, I used to have the mud guard slide underneath the brake calipers. I've got them, especially the back one, it now stops before it gets to the brake caliper, which is fine. And they're so easy to adjust as well, these SKS race blade mud guards, absolutely superb. Right, just heading for home now guys. Thank you so much you for a lovely watching. Sunday. I'll see you tomorrow night in the Shed of Wonder for the FCC Strava Group review. Really looking forward to that. I will be absolutely nowhere in the top 100. So it should be interesting to see where I am. Guys, look after yourselves, take care out there and enjoy your riding. I'll see you tomorrow.